what's up you guys welcome back to the channel and welcome to my surgery vlog you can get in the car so pretty much getting surgery on my knee i guess we could do like a a background story if you will yeah mm -hmm. i think it was in 2015 yes um i tore my mpfl So I got um, surgery to repair it and they relocated my patella tendon and then I guess fast forward to last July my knee wouldn't bend it kept catching on something so I went to the doctor and got an MRI and it said that there was scar tissue and the cartilage behind my kneecap was damaged he pretty much said to wear a knee brace and that I didn't need to come back unless my knee got swollen. We went to the doctor that originally did my knee surgery because my knee was still hurting a lot. And they said that if they didn't clean up the cartilage, then I would uh, need to get a joint replacement at 26. So they're going to clean they're gonna reconstruct your now. With a cadaver ligament. And then they're gonna clean up the cartilage and they're going to move my patella down because it sits up too high and that's why it shifts a lot, which I guess is what stretches my MPFL out, which is why they are gonna, you said, reconstruct it. So we're on our way to this is called a pre-op appointment. Mm -hmm. And your brace fitting. And a brace fitting. So I'm going to get fitted for a brace. And originally I was going to get COVID tested, but since I've been vaccinated, they just said to bring my card in. So that's cool. I don't have to get my brain tickled. So we're going there. And I guess get fitted for a brace. I mean, I can't be the leader. Please. Sorry. Okay. Were you guys here to see? Uh, Pre-admission testing. Okay. Any symptoms for everybody? No. Or for you, rather? No. <laughs> Maybe kind of scooch to the edge of the chair and just straighten your leg up for me. I'm just going to eyeball it, kind of size it up. I'll let you know if I need you to do anything. But if I'm doing anything that bothers you, just let me know. Okay. Leave it um, loose when we first set it up because after surgery, there's going to be dressings and stuff going on, swelling, so we don't mm -hmm. tighten it all the way down. We're done. That was kind of a mess. Oh, I didn't have to do the pre-admission testing because I didn't have to get COVID tested. So when we canceled that, they must have just like canceled everything because they said that I didn't have an appointment to get my brace fitted either. But they figured it out and I got a giant freaking brace and also an ice machine. Is that it? Yeah, now we're going to lunch. Yeah. My surgery is in three days. So they said to come back with the brace and the ice machine. And it's going to be a horrible time. Welcome to surgery day. We're about to leave and head to the, the surgery center. I don't know. Um, but yeah. Goodbye, Finnegan. Oh my god, I don't want to go first. I don't want to go first. Good, how are you? Good. Any symptoms of COVID for either of you? No. Any contact with anyone who's tested positive? No. Okay, I just got to grab the temperatures really quickly. All right, you can eat Travis sticker, you're all set. Thank you. Do you need help finding where you're going? She's seven. Okay, yeah, you can just go right upstairs to the second floor. Thank you. I'm waiting to get my pre-admission testing. I got my bracelet. And then, what did they say? That a nurse will call me back? We're waiting. And I wanna die a little bit. 
Yeah, I'm done with my pre-admission testing. They answered me 5,000 questions. And now I am waiting for a nurse to take me back to prep for surgery. This has taken forever and I really need to pee. I'm waiting for them to take my urine. My surgery is literally scheduled in 40 minutes. And I still haven't gotten taken back. I don't know why this is taking so long. I've been called back and the first thing I did was pee in a cup. So that's great. And the surgery is still scheduled for 9.30, so. Okay, here's my beautiful attire. Here it goes. Looking good. It's showtime. Like, I need help. Oh. Do I look beautiful? Oh. You look gorgeous. Yes, that's very becoming. <laughs> okay. Katie's all ready. I'm excited to take a nap. Excited to take a nap? Two hour nap. Yes. All ready to go. Yeah, so I can. my leg. So we'll get you all the way to sleep for the surgery, okay? You got an IV in her any? Back in the back, we you still do the stuff through the IV? Off to sleep, okay? Beforehand, we'll give you an oxygen mask just to breathe oxygen for a little while, okay? Uh, but first, we'll get over and do a block on you. We're gonna cut some of that pain out. You can't take it all the way away. The block helps, but it doesn't knock it all out, but it helps a lot, okay? So they'll give you some sedation first in the IV back there, and it's gonna be a little shot right on the inside of the thigh here, and um, it covers pretty much like the top of the knee and then inside here, okay? It doesn't cover the outside, doesn't cover the back, all right? But where he's working, this isn't the main part of it, okay? Sound good? Yep. Yeah. Okay, bye. Got my nerve block. Got my nerve block. And it was really weird. And that needle was like this long. Wow. And your blood pressure is really high. <laughs> and what were you talking about? The nerve block? Um, the needle. Yeah, it burned. It was really, it burned. Mm. And we were putting it in. Much better. Uh, surgery is supposed to start at 9 30. It's 9 50. Mm -hmm. I also did acquire a new bracelet. And they did let me wear it bra and underwear. So that's that's nice. Yeah, that's nice for me. So now we wait. I don't know what the next step is. We're waiting to meet my surgeon. Also, when I was getting my nerve block, they had pictures of the beach on the ceiling for me to look at. Hmm. So they stabbed me with a needle this big again. This this big. <laughs> Shoving it in my leg. Hmm. Mimi said that she had a nerve block in her arm, but she couldn't pick her arm up. So then I'm like, oh my god, it's not working. But like, it is if you poke it. It's real numb. I can still feel it though. <laughs> Not up here. Literally, it's just down here. The doctor is coming to mark my knee. These are my two screws. And they're gonna go bye bye. Say goodbye to them. We're gonna say goodbye to them. And then we're gonna replace them with the new. Yes, new, new screws. screws. I wish that they would let me see them. Tell him that you want them to put them in a bag and give them to you. I would never be able to speak to him. It's almost time. What time is it? 10.25. 10.25. You want to see my smiley face? Got the smiley face. And the doctor's signature. Mimi asked if I could see the screws. And they said that he could probably do that. But the state does not allow you to take them. That's okay, I don't want them. <laughs> so he said that they're just gonna cut along the same incision from before and then there's gonna be another one on the inside. 
Getting ready to roll. Mm -hmm. That's been night. Nope. All right. That was your final check. <laughs> All right. Love you. Okay. Yeah, I used it. Okay, Kitty just went back to surgery. Um, we're here. We're gonna pick up some donuts for her so we can take them to her um, as long as she's feeling good after surgery. I think we're gonna stop by and visit her and bring her some donuts. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want to. We've secured the donuts. Okay, we're gonna do a donut haul. I don't know how many, oh my God. Oh my goodness. So that's lemon crumble, crumble, peanut butter and jelly, white chocolate raspberry, black forest, Reese's, uh, Tank 5, apple crunch, Samoa, another white chocolate raspberry, such as Oreo, Death by chocolate, Death by chocolate, I think I'm on the M one. Did you get lemon curd and this is lemon crumb? Oh, that's key lime. Key lime. And lemon crumb. Oh, I want beautiful. the Emma M. That one is for you. Yes. <laughs> I want one. Okay. Getting ready to start her surgery. Here it is. Surgery start. 10.59. Doctor just came out. Surgery went well. Time is... 12.39, so they should be calling me back pretty soon. She's in the uh, recovery, and uh, he gave me pictures, so she'll enjoy seeing those. So, update in one second, go back. I'm done. You're done? Yeah. And she's really cold. Yeah, so she has lots and lots of blankets on everywhere. It's so cold. No crackers? Yeah. You guys tell me, I'm going to let you I don't know if my knee hurts or if it's just cold. It probably hurts. And I want to drink on my apple juice. I can do that. And these are the screws that he took out of her knee. Um, my leg hurts. And I'm tired. And she's cold. And I'm cool. And I put in my what are these called? Graham crackers. Graham crackers. And apple juice. And they went to get her some medicine. Here's my leg. This is my um ice machine, which is down there. But it's real cold. My giant brace. The quad. My IV has been taken out, and my ice machine has been unhooked. Also, my knee doesn't hurt anymore, and I'm not cold. But you're, yeah, you are very red. Yeah, it's from like the is heart it like rate heart? monitors. Yeah, adhesives like. Oh my goodness. You're coming undone. Adhesives like make my skin break out. So, what can you do? An update. On the update, I have been dressed. And here's my leg. Yep. What is this? Probably where they had the tourniquet. I'm gonna guess. Hmm. I told you they put a tourniquet on there. So it's nice and yeah. This? That's from the tourniquet. Oh, look at that. Yeah. Yep. Hmm. Just got to the car. Gonna go around and pick Katie up. Had to take Jackson's car seat out so that she could sit with her leg up in the back seat. So we're on our way to get Katie now. What's that? Yep. A uh, little side note is that my nose itches so bad. And there's like, it almost looks like a bruise. Yeah, that's what I think. 
from the oxygen masks. I don't know what the heck is going on. But my nose is just so bad. And they bruised my face. Hmm. Okay, we got the setup. Lucky here. No, my friend come to see me because she's so nice. Yeah, I came to take care of her. We got our our brace and our ice and some crackers. Yeah. And Mimi's gonna go pick up her meds. And we're gonna um, watch Loki. Maybe. Yes. We're gonna watch Loki. Okay, she's trying out her donuts. She picked um, take five and white chocolate raspberry. How are they? Um, this one doesn't taste like a take five. And I, no, I love take fives too. It's like my favorite chocolate. And you've been out of surgery like four or five hours? How are you feeling? I think I like donuts. Donuts and pain meds. She's doing good. Okay, here. Yeah, and you, I took a nap too. Yeah, she took a little baby nap while I watched Loki. She already watched it, so. <laughs> yeah. Did you like it? Yeah, I did like it. <laughs> did you watch both episodes? Yeah. Yeah. Did you like it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm just like, you can't see the face I'm making, but <laughs> that's all. Okay, it's been five minutes. <laughs> yeah, we're not gonna eat more food. Now we're having an acai bowl. Yeah, and some boba tea. Yes. Jackson, what are you eating? Okay, sounds good. Um, Mimi. All right, well, that's probably going to conclude this video. I'm just chilling at home with my goodies, gonna watch probably TV and do nothing else but sit on my butt for a couple days. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and see you next time. Bye. Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. Can I, can I, can I do this? <laughs>